First time you will need to catch a snail will be during a quest called the Baited. And to do so, you need to craft or buy two fishing poles, one with the lucky day 2 and the other with the lucky night 2. Also, you have to gather a few bushes you can find in any forest area. That will occasionally loot a few wood loose bait you will need to catch the snails. Once you have a dozen of this bait and the fishing poles mentioned before, it's time to go to the bottom right side of the first light area. Where on the right side of the city you can notice a bridge you have to cross, on the other side of which you can notice a circular landmark. Well, in the top left side of it you will notice a small lake that will have a fishing hotspot area. That is a small pond in the middle of the ruins. Well, you have to go around it until near some bulrush plants you will find a few fishes jumping out from the water. The fishing hotspot is exactly this small area. Now that you found it, it's time to equip the fishing pole with the lucky day or lucky night based if it's day or night. Next step is to equip the wood loose bait. And finally, cast the line exactly in this small area. If you did it correctly, you will notice a blue text saying landed on hotspot. There are two reasons why you have to fish in this exact area. The first is that you will be able to fish faster considering that you will catch the fishes immediately after casting the line. The second is that exactly from this hotspot you will be able to catch the snails. But keep in mind that the hotspot can be exhausted by you and other players as well. The exhausted hotspot will replace the fishes with the foam. Anyway, if the hotspot will be exhausted before you will be able to catch a snail, get on the other side of the bridge near the day spring mills upon the city. Then continue going to the left until you will reach the Hedgeburg fishery, where another fishing hotspot that drops snails can be found. On the right side of the pond you will see in the map. Once you reach the area described, you will find the two houses with a passage in between them. Using this passage, you will see a small pier dog with the fishing hotspot on its right. In one of these hotspots, I was able to collect 13 snails before it was depleted. So here you can find not only the one for the quest, but also farm them if you want to. A little note, traveling between the two hotspots, it will allow you to find a lot of bushes to gather in order to get some bait. Keep in mind that usually it takes 30 minutes for a hotspot to be restored. So traveling between them is more productive than just waiting for it to respawn.